Rita Wood, and this year I'm second vice president of the Ranch Marge Women's Club. That uh, started back in October of 1963 at the intersection of Bob Hope and 111 when there was a landing strip and a little hotel and a little restaurant there. And a group of five women were sitting around and decided they should start a club where they could help, you know, the kids here in the community and so forth. I'll just say about the women that I've met from Rancho Marge Women's Club, Rita included, spectacular people. Just full of energy, full of life, they care about the community, and they put on events like these not because it's fun, but because they know what it's going to do for the community, and because they think it's important to band together behind causes like these. I have just had a blast getting to know all the women uh, that were involved both in the fashion show behind the scenes and you know the ones that I've met through the Rancho Mirage Women's Club and they're genuinely just fantastic people and women that I look up to as well. And I think it's kind of cool, you know, a lot of the organizations that were benefiting from the Rancho Mirage Women's Club's fashion show were children's organizations. So to be able to say, hey, the women of Rancho Mirage were able to donate this money, they were able to do this for the youth, that's an important message right now. It's important that we're raising young people, that uh, female role models are important, and that they can have that by looking at the Rancho Mirage Women's Club. We do have a club flower, the verbena on the mountainsides when you see it in the spring, when the spring flowers come out, that it's just, you know, really powerful. And so that's the same idea with women. Just an individual, you know, we maybe can't do a heck of a lot on our own, but with a large group, then we can accomplish.